afternoon everyone and welcome hey guys welcome to another video of delicious food we have starbucks seasonal treats so what do we got so we have a little snowman cookie basically just like a little sugar cookie got a snowman on him we have a cranberry bliss bar which this looks just like some cake with she told me it had cream cheese on the top of it with some ice and drizzle and little pieces of cranberry that's good this is a scone cranberry um and then the best of the best is the little um snowman cake pop except we had to cut it in half where he could try some and i could try some so it has a little snowman face on it she told me a little bit about these, so I'm excited to try them because when I was buying them, she was like telling me all the stuff that's in them and it sounded really delicious, so. So, I don't think this is everything. I think they have a few more or a couple more. I, I know they have like this um, orange cream thing, but these was available at the Starbucks that in we our, went to. Yeah, in our area. Um, I'm sure if we went to another one that's probably right down the street, they'll probably have something uh, that's that this one didn't have. Um, but we're gonna try each one of these out and tell you what we think. So hold on, before we start, which one are you most excited about? The cake pop. <laughs> <laughs> if you've ever been to Starbucks, you know they have like the most delicious cake pops ever. But I'm actually most excited about the Cranberry Bliss Bar because I love cream cheese. And you should see the layer of cream cheese on this bar. It is so thick. So, which one do you want to try for? I have a number one through four how I ordered them. So, let's do it like that. One, two, three, four. Let's do so it like that. what was the first one? The first one was the Cranberry Bliss Bar. Cranberry, cranberry Bliss. I'm going to try to... Oh, you gave me the bigger piece? All right, so Are we going to cheers these? Wow, look how thick that layer of cream cheese is on the top. It looks good. That is so good. So I thought this, and I wasn't really sure, but now that I've bit into this, I'm very sure. It kind of has like shavings of orange in them. And the the scone says cranberry orange. And if you look at this, you can tell it has like little pieces of orange in it. Um, but it's really good actually. Yeah, that cranberry that was, is good. That was really good. Um, I felt like it's not a strong taste of the cranberry though. The cream cheese and the cranberry and the little tiny spritz of orange it has in it really mix well together. It was very moist. Yeah. I think um that was really good actually. That one, that was good. We always get something that we can like break and break apart and share. And sometimes I wish we got two of these things because sometimes it's really yeah. good. Like the cake pop, he was upset. He was like, "Should have yeah, got we, two. We should have got two cake pops. <laughs> we need our own cake pop to try." So the next thing we're gonna try is number two is the cake pop. It says oh. item two of four. Are you so excited? Yeah, because <laughs> he good. loves their cake pops. But I wonder what it tastes vanilla like. Just vanilla vanilla icing. And you can kind of even see like the cake even looks moist on the inside. I have most of his little right, snowman. So the cake pop. Mm hmm. Starbucks. Most of their stuff is always real moist. I never have really got anything there that was dry. That was good. We knew that was going to be good. It's just <laughs> um, vanilla cake with a vanilla icing. And it had a little snowman's face on it. That was really good. I can eat about four or five more of those. What he kind of had an idea of what the treats were already. So when I brought home that cake pop, he was like, a cake pop? He did know not know. <laughs> he was so excited. He was like, oh, I'm ready to eat that now. Yes. Okay, so number three is the snowman. All the snowman is is like a shortbread cookie with some vanilla icing 
decorated like a little snowman and they've even got like i got the bottom part so it even has like little bits of sugar to kind of look like mm, snow crystals yeah. or something but here we go snowman I did not like that. That's like too much cookie or something. Well, it's just a, like a shortbread cookie. It's not a sugar cookie. With icing on it. But I think the icing has like a cream cheese taste to it. Mm-hmm. Something. I didn't really something like with that the one. icing is not, is not working. Um, that was not very good. And, and it, it was a little dry. It wasn't, it's not a, well, it's a soft it's, cookie, it's, but it's, it's not. It's a soft cookie, but it's not a chewy soft cookie. Um, it's not crunchy, <clears throat> but it's a good cookie. It's just, I think the icing. Throws you off somewhere. Yeah, I don't like the fact of the icing. Okay, so this is the cranberry scone. And I think it has orange in it as well. It says scone cranberry or which i'm assuming stands yeah. for orange um it has like a little drizzle of icing going across the top of it and it is full of cranberries i don't think i'm gonna like this one i'm not a fan of cranberry so i didn't cheers on the snowman cookie the first bite has a huge chunk of cranberry It's a scone. Yeah. It's, it's definitely a scone. Um, Which is just a bread, sweet bread and pastry. And, and I actually like it. Yeah, it's really good. I think um, it's good. The cranberries are really juicy. Like when you bite into them, they have like a lot. Yeah, they're, they're really good, moist. actually. Um, the bread is real soft. It's not dry or anything. In these two cranberry things, though, you can definitely taste the spritz of orange. Do you taste it? Like, do you get like a little hint of orange in it? Maybe just a little. And um, I got it in the cranberry bliss bar as well, but I said, I don't think you tasted it in the bliss bar, did you? The little spritz of orange. No, you can see it see though. Them. It's definitely there. Um, I don't think it's, to me, it looks more like garnish than yeah. something meant for flavor. But this was pretty good, <clears throat> believe it or not. I didn't think, I thought this was going to be my worst, the one that I hated the most. But um, it's actually pretty good. I um I was worried about the cranberries too because if cranberries get old, they get like what kind of puny like, and they're not good at all. These tasted like some fresh cranberries. Um, yeah, it's not dry. This is something I would eat again. The cranberries are definitely something I would eat again. Now the Bliss Bar is my favorite, so if you go to Starbucks, you got to try this out because it is delicious. Okay, that so that cream cheese is delicious. One to one to four, my favorites. Number one, the cake pop. That was a know all because he loves the cake pops. Number two, the bliss bar. Number three would be the scone, and number four would be the cookie. So, so what do you think? Bliss bar is my favorite because that cream cheese is just delicious. Um, number two is the cake pop. Three is the scone, and four is the cookie. So I guess. We both decided that the cookie was not the best thing to get. So, if you go to Starbucks, don't make that your first pick. Try something different. I think it's the icing. I don't know, but it's not good. Something with the icing. And I feel I like... It's cream cheese icing or what? I feel like most people want something that they can pair with their coffee. Because most people go to Starbucks to get coffee. So, to me... The scone, scone would be best with is, coffee. Yeah, it sounds like a good, hey, let's go get coffee and a cookies. scone before breakfast. So these were my two favorite because I love coffee. So when I was trying them, I thought, could I drink this with a cup of coffee? 
yeah. you don't drink as much coffee as I do, but. Yeah, these are really good. Um, I suggest if you like Starbucks, uh, try these out. Um, first try, the cake pop, you can get cake pop, pop any All year round. So I would say, you know, that being third on the list to try, the cookie, don't worry about that. But um, I would say the number one thing to try, if you wanted to really try these, would be the list, list bar. bar. I agree with that, that. That is something very unique, very good. Um, only for now. It's a, it yeah, is only is, seasonal. So like he said, the cake pop, you can get that any time of the year. And there's different flavors. And most of the time, the cake pops, they just put different color icing on them based on the holiday. They never really change them. But this is, these two right here are definitely seasonal items. So got to go try them now. Yes. And um, there's one more seasonal item that we're going to do a video on. Um, coming soon so be sure to subscribe but it's going to be more along the lines of a drink um, I don't want to give too much information about it but we're going to try something um, else that they have to offer that's uh, seasonal but um, anything else you want to add? No y'all just hurry up and get some of these because yeah. they're delicious and if there's like I know we have tried other seasonal things or new things in previous videos if you know of anywhere that has like seasonal treats or treats that just came out let us know because we definitely want to go get them and try them and see what they're like and tell you guys um, we like doing stuff like this yeah and uh, comment down below if you tried these things as well or if you're going to try something uh, that we showed here let us know your thoughts on it um, other than that I think that's all we have for this video by the way where's, where's Timmy, Timmy?